Number one, a physics major's cooking breakfast when he notices that the frictional force between his steel spatula and his Teflon frying pan is only 0.2 newtons. Knowing the coefficient of kinetic friction between the two materials, he quick, quickly calculates the normal force. What is it? So I copy and pasted the table from your textbook. So we're looking for the coefficient of kinetic friction uh, between the steel uh, spatula and the Teflon fr uh, frying pan. So it looks like right here will be the value, uh, or at least that's the system, I should say. And this is the value because we're looking at it for kinetic friction. So now what we need to do is we need to realize how do we rate, uh, how do we relate the kinetic friction, right, which is represented as mu sub k, and that value is 0.4, oh, 0 0.04. And the uh, they told us that the frictional force, so F sub F, is equal to 0 0.200 newtons. How do we calculate now the normal force, or F sub N? Well, we have a relationship over here on the right-hand side, right? The force of kinetic friction equals the coefficient of kinetic friction multiplied by the normal force. So let's write that. So the uh, force of kinetic friction, right, is equal to uh, mu sub k multiplied by f sub n. All right. So the uh, co uh, excuse me, the frictional force, the kinetic frictional force, is 0 0.0200. The constant is going to be 0 0.04, and the uh, Normal force is going to be the unknown, so simply all we have to do here is just divide by the 0 0.04. And the normal force here, we find it to be 0.2 divided by 0 0.04, and it comes out to be 5. And it looks like we'll do maybe how many sig figs? Well, the kinetic friction only has one, so actually I should just have one significant figure here. So 5 newtons, that will be the final answer. Thanks guys for tuning in, appreciate it very much. Please remember to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next question.